bless me a lot, bless everything, but on top, Alhamdulillah. Let me tell you a story real quick. Alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah. Step out the house, no strap on me. Peace and blessings to King Hanisa D. I'm just sending a friendly reminder out to all my Muslim out there that Ramadan is here and it's time to fast, y'all. If you don't know what Ramadan is, follow my page. I'm taking time out away from music and focusing my mind on like creating things so people can know more about Islam and know more about what we do and how we practice and how I practice personally. Most people think that Islam is about Arab culture or you know, Saudi Arabian culture. And a lot of people don't know that Islam is about uniting people. It doesn't matter what color you are, no matter if you're a white Muslim, a black Muslim, an African Muslim, an Asian Muslim. Everybody is together. Everybody is the same. Nobody is different. We all are one. I'm with all my ox right now. Everybody say, Salaam Alaikum. So, I mean, let's just be natural as possible, I, like for real. So, um, like I said before, first of all, how you doing? Shit. I'm good. Alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah. I'm blessed. Alhamdulillah. I'm blessed. Same thing. So, Ramadan starting out, and I feel like it's a lot of things that people don't know about Islam. You know what I'm saying? I, I was out there up in uh, Taiwan and I was beating people that was from Indonesia. I was meeting people that was from Africa that had a lot of knowledge. You know what I'm saying? But still, I don't want to call people out, but I was meeting people that, you know, grew up around Islam and really didn't have the knowledge that comes with it. And I say that to say it's a lot of brothers out here who, you know, say I'm Muslim. But they don't know how to do the al-fatiha, you know what I'm saying? They don't know how to do the salah. They don't know the traditions and meaning of Islam and what it is. So I just want to start off, since it's Ramadan, let's just explain what Ramadan is. Yeah. <laughs> To translate, I stated, um, I seek refuge with Allah from the from the uh, curse Satan in the name of God, most gracious, most merciful. All praise due to Allah, Lord of the worlds. I bear witness that there ain't no God but Allah, and I bear witness that Muhammad is his messenger. Allah bless Muhammad and his descendants. Right? Assalamu alaikum. Wa alaikum salam. I'm tilab kaatu. Alhamdulillah. Well, um, Ramadan, Ramadan is a blessed month, right? Because uh, this was the month that the, the the Quran was revealed. You know, it's a, it's a book of guidance. Yeah. So during this month, during this month, you know, we fast twenty nine to thirty days, right? Yeah. And um, in, in the Quran, Allah says, speaking about this month, He said, "Audhu billahi min al-shaytan al-rajim." Bismillahi r-Rahman r-Rahim. In the name of Allah, most gracious, most merciful, he said, Oh you who oh you who believe, fasting is prescribed to you as it was prescribed to those before you that ye may learn self restraint. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So it, it's like it's an obligation, you know what I'm saying? It's ordained. Fasting is ordained for us so we may learn how to be more conscious of Allah. For instance, just the food part, you an individual refraining from you know, eating and drinking. When you start, when that hunger hit, I mean, where does food stem from? Where does it come from? It comes from this creator. You know what I'm saying? So it causes us to be mindful of this creator, right? It's a month of purifying oneself, striving to better one conduct, striving to get closer to God. But the only way this can take place is, you know, by being conscious of God, you know what I'm saying? Like yeah. in every action. So it's a month of, you know, awareness, forgiveness, right? And um, said that, you know, fasting, it's a, it's a purification agent. But then, you feel me? So this is what, this is the, during this month, this is what we're doing. You know, we're striving to get closer to this creator. You know, we're grateful for, for, for this book of guidance that this creator has bestowed upon us.
us. You know what I'm saying? But just, you know, simple and simple terms. All right. What about people? What about people? All right. So what about people who, you know, have little knowledge, but they Muslim and, you know, they convert. How could they practice? I'm trying to I'm trying to come up with a way out on how people could, you know, practice this month in the best form of their capabilities. So we talking about people who, you know, every day don't go read the Quran or don't have the knowledge of understanding the Quran. You know what I'm saying? The words of Allah, you know, that's real deep stuff to try to endure, you know, as a convert, as a new person, because you got to know historical facts. You know what I'm saying? You have to know, you know, language, you have to know culture. You know, a lot of people didn't take the time out like we took the time out to, you know, learn this stuff. So I would like to start off like just with the basics, uh, like n other things that I feel like people could do during this time is, you know, this is a time to get together with loved ones. Exactly. You know, that's prescribed during this time. Like, you know, spend time with your family, you know, quality time. And, you know, we spending this quality time not only for each other, but just, you know, for a lot. So can you, can you, can you, you know, express on that? Well, um, you know, we should not neglect the Quran, you know what I'm saying? So this yeah. is the month, you know, you get up in that book and you, you strive to read, you know, you dedicate this time to, to, to this creator, you know what I'm saying? And mm -hmm. by you dedicating this time, or that time to the creator, you know, you're going to benefit as well. Mm -hmm. You know, we always say for the cause of God, but what's for the cause of God is also for the benefit of mankind. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So we want to strive to um, get closer closer to, you know, the message and stuff like that. And like you said, your loved one and stuff like that. You know, during this month, the prophet, peace be upon him and his descendants, right? He was, he was, um, he was, um, hella generous and stuff like that. Like I said, you know, we just have to, inshallah, if God wills, focus on our morals, brother, right? How, how we conduct ourselves on this earth, right? An individual could get up into the Quran and go try and extract ruling, but that takes a long time. So if you're not qualified, then you have to follow somebody that's qualified. But that's not what our that's not what our society suffers from right now our societies suffer from the way we conduct ourselves simple stuff as muslim we can't even keep our words you know what i'm saying lying cheating deceiving you know it started with these women mm -hmm. you know what i'm saying how we treat how we treat women brother right we don't have no type of self-control and this is this is what's going on right now in the west right and it's people out here that's in in charge that's capitalizing on that yeah. You know, place you in an environment knowing how you gonna think in that environment. You know, knowing that knowing knowing the results and it's not a lot of people that come out of that environment successful, not as far as material wise, but having understanding because yeah. success lies in your understanding. Yeah. Right? And yo, yo, yo your ability to not fall victim no matter what environment you're placed in. You know, and this is what we suffer from, you know, where morally decaying. Yeah. Right? So for all Muslims non-muslims brother we have to focus on our conduct right and you don't have to do a lot to focus on your conduct right we follow that's why we follow the prophet he was the best example on how to conduct himself he was the best example on how to apply this book right and and his descendants those who descended from him right so that's the guy when i talk like this they say i'm too honest when they put us on ships, now they don't talk about them Been a king, that's why I'm dipped down in hella gold Got more than one, read your book, save your own soul Pray five times a day, I'm in beast mode Cross the line, gotta survive what they do for God